And as we can see, that didn't work and I disappeared for like five months, but that's okay, I'm back now. I don't think I'm gonna be going anywhere this time. I feel like that's gonna become an ironic statement soon. Oops, um, that was two years ago. Hi guys, um, it's, <laughs> it's me, Keystone Mapping, and welcome to the alternate future of Keystone Mapping, where um, I lead a happy life as a professional popular mapper. Uh, no, okay, so I want to talk about why I've been gone for like two years, and also what happened, where I've been, what I plan on doing with this channel, if it's ever going to become active again, etc, etc. So I'm going to burn through this really fast, I don't have a script, I just want to talk about what's on my mind. Alright, so I haven't posted since October 2022, uh, which was two years ago. Uh, the reason for this is because I started Future USA when I was 16 years old. And even though I had been mapping since I was 12, I was still pretty novice. And so I didn't know what I was doing. Um, I was kind of good at storytelling, but the way I would storytell did not make sense. Um, <laughs> I would do things such as just throw things down onto my drawing program. I would script as I went instead of actually taking the time to make a script before I started editing a video together. And that was the reason why the plot was so insane and convoluted and hard to follow because I didn't know what I was doing either. And I just closed my eyes and took a shot in the dark and it did not work because I could not keep up with the things I was writing and setting myself up for and I lost my motivation. And I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate Future USA. I think the writing is okay. The plot is really bad though. I hate the idea of elements in the lakes and they're like controlling people, mind hypnosis. What the? That's so stupid. I hate it so much. And so I want to rewrite everything. Now here's, I have two options for myself and for you guys. Um, as a disclaimer, uh, I do not want to stray from uh, Future USA very much. I might visit Future Canada, I guess, but it's not as likely. The reason I want to stick to Future USA is because I'm more familiar with the ground I've laid out for myself, and as someone from America, it's much easier for me to, you know, write about where I'm from. I understand, like, cultural connections more uh, concretely. But here are my two options. First, I just scrap everything. Everything, everything gone. I mean, it'll stay on the channel, but um, there'll be a disclaimer like, this is the old series, don't watch this, you know. Um, I want to restart from scratch, start from season one, episode one, rewrite everything. Um, I'll keep the characters' personalities the same and all that. Um, I'll keep general, like, plot, plot, <laughs> plot events happening, but I just don't like the idea of, like, the elements in the lakes and, like, mind control, you know, I don't want to do that. Um, so there's option one. The thing is, though, um, if I start from scratch from the beginning, I probably won't finish the series at all because that's four seasons I have to build up. So that's season one and two that I had already sort of made, and then the season three and four that were already planned. So what I would have to do would have to be, I'd trim everything down into like two or three seasons, if that, just so I can like have a concrete resolution. Because I have so many ideas, I need a few seasons. The other option is to keep going with what I've got and just push through until season four is done which I could manage. I think I could do that. The thing is though, um, it would be very difficult and I would definitely stray from what I have already written. So there'd be a lot of plot points that I had set up for the future that will just not happen because I don't like them anymore. If I continue from where I've left off, what I'm going to do when I finish the series is revisit old plot points and make like mini episodes where it's like alternate things that could have happened. So like an alternate, alternate universe. So like, what if this character did this? What if this country did this? What if they invaded this person? What if they won this battle? What if they lost this battle? What if Michigan wasn't fucking insane and everyone hated him? You know, stuff like that. And that's something I want to explore. And so I can only do one or the other though. I, I don't have much time. I have to pick. <laughs> it's either one or the other. And I want you guys to pick or like share your opinions. See if there's any other ideas you want me to pursue. But yeah. Uh, I just, it was hard for you to keep making videos because I didn't like what I was making and the expectation was growing for me to keep going and keep going because people were like, I love your videos. And then when I would be gone for like a little bit, not even one of my long breaks, people were like, where'd you go? Come back. You're not leaving again, are you? And I was like, oh. People just know me as that mapper who leaves. <laughs> so, um, yeah. I want you guys to give your insight on what you think I should do or what you would like to see rather. Um, again, I don't want to continue any series or start new ones. I just want to stick with what I've got. So just let me know what your thoughts are. All right. I am going to stop rambling now. I hope you guys have a wonderful day.
Goodbye.